Unveiling Nature's Paradox, Exploring the Dual Roles of Poisonous Plants in Medicine. Foxglove, known scientifically as Digitalis purpurea, traces its origins back to Europe. This striking plant features tall spikes of purple-pink flowers that have been pivotal in developing heart medications, despite its high toxicity levels. It thrives in acidic soils across various European landscapes. Deadly Nightshade, or Atropa belladonna, is notorious for its dark, bell-shaped flowers and shiny black berries. Historically, it served dual roles in medicine for its sedative properties and in cosmetics as a pupil dilator. This toxic plant is native to Europe, preferring shaded, moist areas. Hemlock, recognized by its umbrella-shaped clusters of small white flowers and a distinctive musty odor, holds a grim place in history as the poison that killed Socrates. Today, its extracts are studied for potential benefits in treating spasms, commonly found in temperate regions. Autumn crocus, known for its beautiful but deceptive flowers, blooms vividly in fall. The discovery of its compound, colchicine, has been crucial in treating gout. However, its high toxicity demands caution. This plant is native to Europe and North Africa, flourishing under diverse conditions. White snake root, with its clusters of fluffy white flowers, is linked historically to the deadly milk sickness that affected many early American settlers. It is used minimally in therapy today, mainly growing wild across North America and impacting local ecosystems and livestock. Foxglove thrives in slightly acidic, well-drained soil rich in organic matter. It prefers cool to temperate climates and partial shade, making it ideal for woodland gardens. Identifying foxglove is easy with its tall spikes of tubular purple-pink flowers that bloom in early summer. Deadly nightshade contains potent alkaloids such as atropine, used medically to dilate pupils and treat nerve pain. This substance, integral to many anesthetic protocols, showcases the plant's significant role in modern medicine despite its high toxicity. Hemlock is easily recognized by its smooth, purple-spotted stem and fern-like leaves that emit a musty odor when crushed. These distinctive traits help distinguish it from non-toxic plants, mitigating the risk of accidental poisoning. The autumn crocus displays a unique blooming cycle, flowering in late summer to early fall without its leaves, which appear in spring. Its saffron-colored blooms are triggered by cooling temperatures, marking the end of the growing season. White snake root plays a crucial role in its ecosystem, affecting both local flora and fauna. Its toxicity, managed naturally, often impacts herbivorous wildlife adversely, but contributes to the plant's survival by deterring grazing. Foxglove has played a pivotal role in cardiac treatment since its discovery. Its active compounds, particularly digoxin, are used in medications to strengthen heart contractions and regulate heartbeats. These drugs are crucial for treating conditions like heart failure and arrhythmias. Deadly Nightshade, known scientifically as Atropa belladonna, contains atropine, a tropane alkaloid used extensively in anesthesia. Atropine helps maintain vital functions during surgery by inhibiting certain nerve responses, thus ensuring that the patient's heart rate and respiratory functions stay stable. Hemlock's extracts have been cautiously explored for their anti-spasmodic properties, offering relief from muscle spasms and tremors. Despite its notorious toxicity, controlled doses are used under strict medical supervision to alleviate symptoms in certain neurological conditions. Research into autumn crocus has significantly advanced the treatment of gout through its compound, colchicine. Colchicine is effective in reducing gout flare-ups by interfering with the inflammation process. Its potential in cancer treatment is also being explored due to its ability to inhibit cell division. White snake root contains toxic compounds that have historically caused milk sickness, particularly affecting livestock and humans consuming contaminated milk. Today, understanding its toxins has led to better diagnostic and treatment methods in veterinary medicine, ensuring safer dairy consumption. Foxglove, known scientifically as Digitalis purpurea, 
is not just admired for its striking blooms, but is also crucial in pharmaceutical applications. Its rarity in the wild has led to conservation efforts, focusing on both protecting natural habitats and cultivating it for medicinal use. Deadly nightshade, or Atropa belladonna, requires specific cultivation techniques to optimize its growth for medicinal harvesting. Growers must navigate legal considerations due to the plant's high toxicity, ensuring that cultivation practices meet regulatory standards to safeguard public health. Hemlock, recognized by its botanical name Conium maculatum, has a notorious reputation for its toxic properties. Efforts to control its spread are vital, focusing on eradication in populated areas to prevent accidental poisonings, while also considering its impact on local ecosystems. Autumn crocus is valued for its medical applications, yet poses significant risks if misidentified. Conservation initiatives aim to sustain its populations through breeding programs and the involvement of botanical gardens, which help educate the public about its safe handling and preservation. White snake root plays a complex role in ecosystems across North America. Its adaptability allows it to thrive in varied environments, prompting research into effective spread prevention techniques and control measures to manage its toxicity in wild settings. Foxglove, known scientifically as Digitalis purpurea, has been a subject of toxicological studies due to its potent cardiac glycosides. Recent findings highlight its dual nature, offering life-saving properties in controlled doses while posing serious risks in cases of overdose. Emergency treatments focus on managing heart rate and electrolyte balance. Deadly Nightshade, or Atropa belladonna, has a storied presence in literature and myth. Traditionally viewed as a plant of witchcraft and enchantment, its real dangers lie in its toxicity. The alkaloids present, such as atropine, can cause delirium and even death if ingested in small quantities. Educational programs focusing on hemlock conium maculatum are crucial due to its toxic nature and similarity to harmless plants. Community outreach and school programs have been effective in teaching the public how to identify and understand the risks associated with this plant. Autumn crocus is often mistaken for similar non-toxic plants, leading to accidental poisonings. Public awareness campaigns emphasize the importance of correct identification and educate on the serious health risks posed by its toxic compound, colchicine, which can be fatal if incorrectly used. Research into the toxins of white snake root, Ageratina altissima, has advanced significantly, uncovering the mechanisms through which its toxin, Trematol, affects both humans and animals. Studies continue to explore potential antidotes, aiming to mitigate the effects of milk sickness, which it famously causes. Foxglove, with its vivid blooms and towering stems, is subject to stringent regulations when grown for medicinal purposes. Cultivators must navigate a complex web of legal requirements, including obtaining appropriate licenses and adhering to export restrictions to ensure compliance and safeguard public health. Deadly nightshade plays a unique role in ecosystems, impacting wildlife with its potent alkaloids. These toxins can deter herbivores, influencing plant community dynamics and promoting biodiversity. Understanding these interactions helps ecologists manage habitats and conserve native species more effectively. Efforts to remove hemlock from public areas require meticulous planning to prevent accidental poisoning. Community involvement is crucial, with local authorities often conducting educational workshops to teach safe removal techniques and disposal methods, ensuring both human safety and environmental protection. Genetic research on autumn crocus is offering insights into the plant's resilience and adaptability. Scientists study its genetic diversity to understand how it copes with climate change, with the aim of enhancing conservation strategies and ensuring its survival in changing environments. As pharmacological research advances, the potential medicinal uses of white snake root are being explored further. Ongoing studies aim to uncover new therapeutic applications, potentially expanding its role in modern medicine and offering new treatment options for various ailments. Thank you for watching. 
We hope you enjoyed the video and learned interesting things. Share the video with friends and foes. Leave a comment for the algorithm. Okay, ciao. Topics idea by Jay Kunze. Video created with Flicky. Speaker Matve. Music at Blind Music. On behalf of Blind Media.